use this. Hey, is is anyone here? I I need help. Decent.
And who the fuck are you? Oh, you finally woke up. Where am I? And who are you? Not even ammonia could wake you up. I thought I'd have to bury you somewhere in the backyard. You are in the infirmary at the Romashka station. My name is Yuri. I am the head and chief engineer of this base. What happened to me? I don't remember anything at all. You must have fallen from the stairs. I found you outside unconscious. But it seems you are fine. Your pupils react to light. Nothing serious. Really? I remember my drop pod entering the atmosphere. I remember the clouds and the sound of the siren, and then nothing. I found your ID card on you. You're probably one of those interns they were supposed to send to help us. We were expecting you several years ago. I never thought they would actually send someone. We were delayed as the company struggled to find suitable specialists to send here. Believe it or not, no one wanted to fly here. The conditions and salaries they offer are just laughable. In short, we woke up from cryosleep, but couldn't establish contact with the surface, so we had to descend at our own risk. Something went wrong, and my drop pod crashed right into the ground near your station. Why wasn't anyone there to meet us? It's a total mess here. I'll explain everything to you when you recover. For now, rest and regain your strength. Head is splitting. Take this injector, it will help. Thanks. Now explain, what the hell is going on here? Our mission was attacked. They landed on the planet's surface a few weeks ago and attacked us. Wait, who are they? Who attacked you? I don't know. They could be some fucking capitalist pigs, corporates, or some kind of mercenary cultist, frankly, I don't care. What matters is that many of our mission bases were attacked and are not responding. I sent several of the Romashka staff to neighboring stations to find out what's going on, but now they're silent too. It seems they are jamming satellite communication. And what's your plan? What are we going to do? First, you need to set up a transmitter somewhere up high nearby. We need to restore communication. Yuri, I was supposed to monitor the weather and record data. I'm a meteorologist, not a mountaineer radio engineer. Plus, I have a fear of heights and asthma. Asthma? Do you also have flat feet? Listen here. You are first and foremost an intern, and I am your boss and the chief engineer of this station. You will follow my orders. Only then we can resist the scoundrels who have taken over the planet. It seems I have no choice. To make it easier for you, I'll give you a gun. I used it for hunting the local fauna, but I think I'll hold off on hunting for now. Head to the nearest height and set up the relay. All right, I'll do it. Hmm. 
interesting. Use this. Here we go. No, I 
know you! Should have installed this transmitter! This planet is under my personal control! Don't get in my way! Goodbye! Excellent, you did it! I'm almost proud of you, intern! Thanks to the transmitter, I was able to contact one of our employees. She needs help. She's at the local bar. Yes, there's a bar on this damn planet. Don't be surprised. Go ahead. I'm counting on you. stormed out of here so quickly I forgot to tell you. The company kind of wants its property back. And there is, like, a lot of property around here. The problem is, it's all occupied by these ungrateful parasites playing anarchists. Feel free to pull the vermin infestation out. I will make sure Rostock knows about your contribution to their asset security. You have a real bar here. Wow, a new face. Haven't seen you here before. Are you from the distant stations? I just arrived on the planet. You don't look like those invaders. Did the 
company send someone to help us? No. I'm just a meteorology intern, studying the weather. Oh, the weather here is just awesome. Dust storms, acid rains, in short, excellent material for study. It seems a bit empty here, doesn't it? Lately, business at the bar hasn't been great. After the planet was captured, colonists rarely leave their stations, and besides, our competitor, Tasty and Cosmos, has taken some of the local clientele. What? Tasty and Cosmos? Is there really a Tasty and Cosmos on this rundown planet? I used to go there every week on Earth. Well, there you go. Another fast food enjoyer. Listen, I'm actually here on business. I was sent here by Yuri from the Romashka station, looking for our colleague. She last contacted us from your bar. Yuri? Yes, I know Yuri. <laughs> he used to visit us often. Sat right on the stool, drank beer, and always grumbled. Yes, that sounds like Yuri. I know which colleague you're talking about. She stumbled in, covered in some slime, waving a gun and shouting about some crab people, and behaving very erratically. What happened to her? Where is she? She's fine. She drank more than usual, collapsed right on the bar counter. I laid her in the back room on the second floor. But even then, she kept muttering something about horror from the depths. <sighs> I've seen this many times. Some colonists just can't handle their drink. Um, and don't even mention it. Yuri seems to be drinking medical alcohol. Here's the key to the room. You can check on your colleague. Huh. Go to Daddy. Thank you. I hope she didn't cause you too much trouble. Another idiot from the inner worlds, huh? Yuri sent me to help you. Crab people, Ian. They came from the Abyss. They are after me. Crab people, huh? Why not cray people or shrimp people? There's nothing like that on this planet except crab sticks. Calm down. I saw them. Uh. I fought them. I hear their call. You've just overdone it with alcohol. All of you seem to be hitting the bottle pretty hard. We'll get you to the Romashka station, and everything will be fine. Yes, we definitely need to get back to the station. It's safer there. But it seems the bartender took my gun. With Yuri, jokes are no good. If I allow the loss of expensive equipment, its cost will be deducted from my salary. I'll try to convince the bartender to return the gun.
Listen, could you return the gun to us? What gun? Well, Sarah's gun. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> there was no gun. You yourself said that Sarah was waving a gun here. Nothing like that happened. I don't know anything about any guns. So that's how it is. You know, the bartender doesn't seem willing to return your gun. Of course. That curly devil would never refuse to snag something. But I know where he might have hidden the gun. There's a utility room near the bar. I helped install a security system there once. The bartender must be hiding his loot there. How do I get in there? To get in there, you'll have to hack the terminal. What do you mean? Hack the terminal? I'm a meteorologist, a specialist in mesospheric clouds. All right, I'll see what I can do. I ain't handing out freebies.